and let's hear it for Lori Wood. Thank you, service host. <laughs> so yes, I am wearing a red bandana, like I'm a blood, but obviously, I'm a crib. <laughs> but I'm not actually in the game. I'm not actually in the game, so if any of y'all are, please don't come after me, because I will not stand for it. Fight. Just so you know, no matter what, it's always win-win for me. I'm always going to win. For real, like say, say you and I get into a fight. In the unlikely event that you're able to get the best of me, I'm confident. <laughs> you just beat up a disabled girl. <laughs> Jerk. seven years ago, and I found that people are very inquisitive and they like to ask a lot of questions. Yeah. <laughs> well, after answering the same question the same way for seven years, I've decided to change up the answers a little bit and have a little more fun with it. <laughs> well, one of those questions, believe it or not, is, can you, like, still have sex? Well, how do you think I ended up as a share? <laughs> You should see him. He's got one of those Superman power wheelchairs. I totally got the better deal. But of course, um, of course I can still have sex. I mean, I broke my back, not my hoo-ha. But now, no sex for me. Life has screwed me enough, thank you. But of course, that's not actually what happened. That's not what landed me in a chair. You know, it was kind of embarrassing, but um, I felt like a stripper pole. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that last discount was a bitch. <laughs> now, there are some things that suck about being in a chair, as you can probably imagine. For instance, when you're walking around going about your everyday life, what's your view? when you look out, all able-bodied and whatnot. <laughs> well, my view is your ass. <laughs> so can y'all stop prop dusting a girl, please? <laughs> I mean, I live life at fart level. <laughs> and y'all are trying to give me pink eye. <laughs> feel sorry for me, but I'm telling you, there's a lot of perks that come along with this whole situation here. Usually it's from the doctor in the form of 10 milligram perk of sex. <laughs> I'll take that. <laughs> but my doctor, he also tells me that I need to be careful about drinking alcohol while I'm taking my opioid pain medication because it doubles the effects of the alcohol, so I'm saving money. <laughs> too much and I fall out my chair, I only feel half the pain. <laughs> but not only am I saving money, but I can make money too. Because for just 20 bucks a pop, I'll tell your kid that this is what happens when you do drugs. <laughs> to 
dating a chick who's paralyzed. But stay with me now, we're gonna have some grip fetishes for me. <laughs> so first of all, I will never run away from the relationship. <laughs> Even if you steal my chair, I will always come crawling back to you. have to work to get me on my knees. <laughs> and remember, I can't feel anything from here down, so uh, all doors are open for business. <laughs> Brag to your buddies like, dude, I was with this chick last night. It was so good, she couldn't walk the next day. <laughs> Once you go again, you never go limp. <laughs> Bet I'm getting some numbers tonight, huh? <laughs> Not you, though, man, because you beat up the sable chicks. 